So you Democrats, you've been in that party a long time. Answer me, what did you get? You got a president. He's worried about his legacy. Well, you want Hillary to get in to protect your legacy because Trump said the minute he get in, he's going to reverse the Affordable Care Act because that's your signature achievement. To show you how hateful the enemy is, he hates that you achieved what you did achieve. So he said, I'm, I'm going to tear it up when I get in. So he don't want his legacy destroyed. Mr. President, let the man do if he get in what he want. Because he's not destroying your legacy. If your legacy is bound up in an Affordable Care Act that only affects a few million people and they're trying to make it really difficult for those of us who signed up, that's not your legacy. But I just want to tell you, Mr. President, you from Chicago and so am I. I go out in the street with the people. I visited the worst neighborhoods. I talked to the gangs. And while I was out there talking to them, they said, you know, Farrakhan, the president ain't never come. Could you get him to come and look after us? There's your legacy, Mr. President. It's in the street with your suffering people, Mr. President. And if you can't go and see about them, then don't worry about your legacy. Because the white people that you've served so well, they'll preserve your legacy. The hell they will. But you didn't earn your legacy with us. We put you there. You fought for the rights of gay people. You fought for the rights of this people and that people. You fight for Israel. Your people are suffering and dying in the streets. That's where your legacy is. Now you failed to do what should have been done. But it's never too late. You, like Jimmy Carter, can be a better president after you leave the restrictions of your white house and come on back to the hood and start organizing like you did. And with your influence all over the world, let's make a new and better people. And from us, if it's Allah's will, we can make a new and better America. Thank you for listening and may Allah bless you as I greet you in peace. Assalamu alaikum.